Hey guys, see you back to MCSG, and today we're playing on Remnant, and I have a topic to talk about today, and that is going to be, um, kind of discussion about the disguise feature slash plugin on, uh, MCSG. So let's get corn, and then we'll get straight into the game. Oh, am I lagging? What? That never happens, ever. I'd meant to press F3 and A to go north this way. Alright, um, so, uh, yeah, I'm going to be talking about the disguise feature. Um, so a while ago they added this feature into MCSG, um, I, I don't know how long ago, it feels like a long time, but it's kind of a recent thing. Um, and basically it's where people who have diamond donor, uh, diamond donor and higher um, can do slash D, and basically change their uh, skin uh, for what it looks like to other people, it changes to a ski, uh, Steve skin, and um, it'll also change the name above their head, and when they type in chat, um, the name will be what it is. Um, in uh, above your head, sorry. Um, people, iron donors and gold donors can do slash D, but it only just gets rid of their, like, uh, yeah, it only makes them appear as a regular player, not a gold or something donor. Um, but it's basically nothing for anyone lower than diamond. Um, so, um, when, the f when the disguise feature first came out, it was very, very, very broken like extremely broken like they should have done a lot more beta testing on the disguise feature to see what's wrong with it but basically um okay boom, boom, boom. so uh if you type if someone's that slash d in the game and then you know the people that person's in the game you type their full minecraft username in um press enter and it would it would have uh come up with their disguise name uh, so basically if you type their full name in and it comes up with the disguise name, you know that they're in the game and that they're that person in the game. Also you could type commands, actually no, you could just do, say, say you just type D and then press tab and um, it would come up with, you know, their, their name. Um, so you could see that they're in the game. So it was really broken um, and then that took a while before the, uh, anything happened, like anything got fixed. Um, and basically, right now, they've... What what just happened? Um, they said they fixed, kind of... Uh, right now, no, no, they fixed the disguise plugin is what they said when they first put it out, but over time, people discovered ways how to find out the slash D of people, um, and that was through uh, using certain commands and then tabbing and all that kind of stuff, which it still sucks, and that's still happening right now. Um, the, the disguise feature is still kind of broken in that sense. Um, and also, uh, it, it's happened in both both versions of the disguise feature um, that they uh, what's it called um, that when you join a game um, and say you're st well, in the second one it's different, but in the second one if you slash D in the hub and then join a game um, when you join a game you'll automatically go um, to you know you'll automatically be the slash D person. Uh, you won't have to type slash D in the game itself. You'll just join the game and not have to do that. Um, but when you join the game, it says that your, like, you know, that your Minecraft username has, uh, joined, and then, it, you know, it will do the command. Um, so basically, uh, actually, no, I'll get into that a bit later, but yeah, it's still broken in kind of that sense where you join a game and it still says your Minecraft username. Um, okay, I guess I'm lagging. Okay, double team. Boop, nope. Only defense there is my bow. Run, run. Um, so yeah, the plugin is still pretty broken at the moment. Just you can do things to find out people's names, and when you join a game, it uh, it says that that person has joined, even if you're slash D in the hub. Um, basically, I was trying to get information on the disguise feature, um, and I found out that when like th they fixed that problem um, where you can type commands in and then tab it and then find out person's name, they fixed that. But, um, what's, okay, he's gappling, um, but they also, uh, let, uh, sorry, I'm getting all mixed up here, so they fixed, um, in a later version of the disguise plugin, they fixed the problem where you can type commands and do, uh, tab to find out the person's name, um, that, I don't think that's been implemented into MCSG yet, but apparently they have done it, um, in a newer version, not sure when they're adding it. Um, and they said they fixed everything about the disguise plugin, um, and then I brought up the issue um, of when you join a game, and it, even if you're slash in the hub and you join a game, it's still like, hey, you with the face joined, and then it will go to your um, your thing, it, then it will disguise you. But um, basically what they said is that when you join a game, it, like it can't do a command before you actually join that lobby. 
um, you have to do something with the database or something, something, something. I didn't even know what they said, but it was like database stuff, and they had to change that. Um, and that would be too difficult to do for every person trying to join. Um, so when people, even if you're slash D in the hub, and you join a game, um, it'll always say that your username has joined um, instead of the disguise name that you had had in the hub or like whatever like that. But basically, that's because it can't do the command before it actually gets into that game, so it has to say that you joined first. Um, yeah, they said there was a way around it, maybe, but it was it, it was difficult, or they wouldn't do it. Um, but they said that shouldn't be an issue anyway, unless you're known in the community, uh, unless like people know you um, in the community and stuff like that. And basically, even if I try and disguise in games, and even if they implement the new version of the disguise feature where you can't do any like commands to find out people's names and stuff like that, I will still always join the game as Deuce 22 meaning people will still know that I'm in the game. And the only way I see around that is being one of the first people into the game, um, waiting in that lobby and wait for everyone to join. Um, but in AU, there's like there's probably two lobbies, uh, or maybe three uh, lobbies at the most, that uh, start... Uh, that fill up and then the rest you know you don't really use that often it can be more like at peak hours and stuff like that um so yeah it's gonna it's like it's kind of hard to be the first one into the game and just kind of sit there for a while um because it kind of fills it fills up quickly most of the time the lobbies um but yeah that's the only way i really see getting around the disguise feature um and the thing is, uh, VIP staff and higher staff, they all have silent join, which means when they join a game, it doesn't say anything when they join. It's just nothing. So it doesn't say their Minecraft username. If they're disguised, it won't say that, I don't think. Um, and, yeah, so they basically don't need to worry about the disguise feature, um, like, if they disguise in the hub, and that, that problem doesn't matter for them. But for people who aren't VIP, um, and, you know, maybe you have over a thousand wounds in MCSG, um, I don't know what region in, but whatever region, and people know you in that region, people know you, and they will target you, and they will kill you, you know, um, yeah, it's not the best when they actually know you're in the game, and people who have wins, and they're known in, th in that, uh, community, uh, you know, people know them, I, I don't even, why am I running around in circles, I'm sorry, um, I'm getting confused with my thoughts, but, anyway, people who aren't VIP, or can't get VIP, and are known in the community are kind of just stuck with the disguise feature. They're basically stuck um, and just have to join games before everyone else um, once they implement that new feature. I know you're a fan and I know that you can kill me, so I'm going to run away. Um, apart. Nope, not, th not like that. Okay, I'll take your stuff. <laughs> I have all right stuff. Um, but yeah, so hopefully they'll implement the new disguise feature. Uh, fix disguise feature soon, um, so this, the, at least the commands are gone that you can do the stuff with, um, but, uh, yeah, um, yeah, I have to be at 10,000 subs minimum to apply for VIP, um, and, uh, not 10,000 subs, so I can't get, like, any silent join privileges, um, unless I got moderator, but I, I don't want to, I honestly don't, I wouldn't, I don't play in the servers enough to be a moderator and it would just cause a bunch more issues um, which I don't want to deal with I might in the future if I just have nothing to do in MCSG so I'm just like yeah why not um, Mr. Cowpants I would like to kill you whoa oh my god the legit flint steel okay you got him a fire but now you're gonna die Mr. Cow just, just come back here yes arrow to the bit okay then um, so I hope that cleared up a few things for you. So they have fixed the disguise feature, but they can't fix the thing where you join the server. Uh, if you're slash D in the hub and you join a server and it says your real Minecraft username, they can't fix that. And they said it shouldn't be an issue um, because, uh, you know, VIPs and stuff, they're the only ones that actually uh, get targeted and stuff like that. But th it's not true, no. Um... You know, yeah, people well known in the community. We just kind of have to put up with it um, if we want to, you know, not be known in the game. Um, ooh, let's craft a sword. Uh, sorry about that. I sneezed. Um, okay. 
Um, so yeah, I hope that enlightened you on the subject of the disguise feature. Um, and they did get new names. Uh, I forgot to mention that. The new names for the disguise people, um, which is a good thing. Uh, still, sometimes it's pretty easy to tell, but sometimes it's not. Um, okay, so let's hopefully um, at least kill someone. Not Geordie Pops, but the other person. Am I on three bars? Yep, I'm on three bars. My internet is terrible, by the way. I might get good ping, but the other half of the time, I'm just on, like, four or three bars to my own, like, kind of region, you know? Tried to record this, like, a bunch of times, but I... Uh, I died? I didn't, I didn't even think I would die, but... But, yeah, normally, yeah, I would just lag out, um, and people would kill me. But, anyway, if you guys enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you out later. Ooh.